Spirit Week is next week. It will start from November 12th to November 15th. And on November 18th, there will be a ceremony for the National Junior Honor Society at 2 p.m. at the 360. On November 19th, there will be a Chinese proficiency test, which is the TOCFL. And wish everyone good luck. So we're here with Mr. John. Um, we're going to interview him today. So, Mr. John, um, how did your past work relate to being a teacher now? So, before I became a teacher, I spent about 15 years in consumer marketing. 15 years in consumer marketing. And there's not much that's the same. Um, what's similar is the importance of relationships. Whether you're working with students or working with colleagues, it's important to have good working relationships. But otherwise, pretty much everything else is different. Do you think working with colleagues are harder than working with students? Or? Well, the power dynamics are certainly different in terms of working <laughs> with colleagues relative to working with students, but I think both of them require you to get to know people and understand them, and then I think that helps build relationships. Oh, okay. So, um, uh, do you find it a little bit homesick in Thailand? Like, do you miss anything? about your home that, does, that doesn't exist here? Well, the big difference between the U.S. and Thailand is the seasons. So in Thailand, we have right the hot season and the hotter season. Mm -hmm. And uh, back in the U.S., the you know, change in seasons is something that um, we miss that you can't get in Thailand. But pretty much everything else you could need or want, you can find in Thailand. So oh, Here it rains a lot. So. <laughs> it does rain here a lot. That's true. Yeah. Um, so. Name one thing, before you came to the school, name one amazing thing that you remember that you did. An amazing thing that I did? Um, I've been skydiving a few times, um, which was pretty amazing. Um, you're not scared of heights? Uh, I was, uh, but not, not so much anymore. Um, that was pretty amazing. And then um, I really enjoyed uh, my one of my last jobs at eBay because we at the built a marketplace that allowed hundreds of thousands of people to oh. find a new way to make to earn a living. So that was pretty exciting as well. Cool. Um, so, if you could gain one quality in someone, like it could be any any quality, what would you gain? Like it's something that you lack that you wish you had. I know this will relate to probably a lot of people watching this and students as well, but I am a bit of a procrastinator, so oh. if I could stop procrastinating, that would be a special power I, I would like to have. I feel like we could have. all relate to that, though. <laughs> yes, true. Um, that's, but that is definitely something I need to work on. Mm. I'm going to start on that tomorrow, though. 
Okay. Um, so, because your English vocabulary is obviously like very excellent, it's very uh, well. Uh, ha- uh, were you very interested in English when you were a kid, or are you like a book smart student? Well, Mr. Jim has been doing a lot of tutoring with me, working one on one to help improve my vocabulary. So I, I'd like to give a shout oh. out to Mr. Jim for his hard work. Thanks, Mr. Jim. You're the best. Um, but yeah, I've always enjoyed I've always enjoyed reading, and I still enjoy reading today. It's one of my favorite things to do. So oh, yeah, vocabulary so big. Um, could you tell us something interesting about you that would probably shock everyone watching this? Uh, I'm actually Peter Parker, um, <laughs> so I'm actually Spider-Man. Is it working? Are they? Is the spider things coming out? No. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Spins a web any size, catches seeds just like flies. Look out! Here comes the Spider-Man. So thank you, Mr. John, for sitting here with me today, um, and you know. Bearing through those questions. Max, it was my pleasure. Anything I can do for WTV, I'm always there for you. Okay, bye.